Now, back in January, you, you politely reminded Canadians resource-dependent Canada uh, needs the U.S. more uh, than the U.S. needs Canada. Well, you know, on uh, a lot of the extractive sector, it's so tremendously important, particularly on oil and gas. I mean, the U.S. has gone from being our biggest customer now to being our biggest competitor. Uh, we also, though, see a huge uh, sea change in public policy in Washington. Uh, the scale of the corporate tax cuts uh, that Trump and uh, the congressional leadership are looking at are significant. The scale of the income tax cuts, the huge uh, changes in regulations uh, will make the United States as a mining jurisdiction a lot more uh, competitive, a lot more powerful. And that's going to put some huge pressures uh, on Canada as we compete for global capital. Now, I, I, you, you were speaking at the PDC, the world's largest mining conference. Uh, most people I speak to uh, in the U.S. especially feel that the Trump administration is, will be friendly and more open to mining. Um, are you seeing this? No, there's no doubt about it. Uh, whether it's his plan to cut substantial percentage of regulation, whether it's appointment uh, of Scott Pruitt as his EPA administrator, this is the most deregulatory uh, pro-business EPA administrator they've had in 50 years since Nixon created the EPA. Uh, you also look on things like, uh, you know, extractive sector on federal lands, uh, just a much, uh, a much more competitive in regulatory environment. And that's going to see a lot of global capital go to the United States uh, and it'll be a real challenge on other jurisdictions to uh, sharpen their pencils and to, uh, and to uh, have to compete more effectively for uh, that capital. Now you also sit, uh, you also act as an advisor for, for Barrick, along with uh, you know, former Speaker of the House Newt Gingrich. How do you see the state of mining? Well, I think in the United States, uh, it's going to become a much more attractive uh, place for mining investment. Um, you look at how well they've done in terms of some jurisdictions. Take uh, Nevada, where they've got a really effective governor, a good you know, regulatory climate. Uh, we're going to see that uh, become the new norm uh, across the United States. Uh, obviously, the uh, number of Republican governors, now uh, Republicans control uh, of both houses and uh, the White House, it's going to be a much easier uh, jurisdiction uh, to do business. And for Canada, for Canadian mining companies who extract here, uh, we're going to have to seek uh, uh, some competitive advantage by getting our government to uh, try to ensure that the regulatory environment here is, uh, is even better than it is today. Thanks for your thoughts. Pleasure to be with you.